City officials say they are just as concerned as the businesses on this. They say meetings like tonight's are just one step toward figuring out how to help this problem. We are having this meeting tonight as concerned business owners to get the city to listen. The Palm Springs police chief and city manager listened intently Wednesday night for a discussion about growing issues with homeless people in the south end of downtown. Business owners frustrated with health and safety hazards like drug use, human feces, and mental illness. All we want to do is be able to go to work, do our jobs, support our clients, and keep ourselves and our employees uh, and our customers safe. City officials looking to reassure their commitment to addressing the problem with short-term solutions. We have two officers assigned to this neighborhood almost full-time uh, with a sergeant who is patrolling the downtown area. We've invested in additional security. We've expanded some of our partnerships with homeless service providers. Is it enough? No. And I think that's the impetus for meetings like this. For the long term, city leaders point to purchasing this nearly $6 million site on McCarthy Road in the north end of the city, set to become a homeless navigation center with services and housing. But for some, that's still a long way off. That's left to be seen. Uh, it could be two years before we see any results. But what are we doing now for the issues that are happening on the street? They're receptive to listening to what's going on, and we'll see if they want to enact some new policies that will help the town. A productive conversation and just the start to solving a mounting crisis on the streets of Palm Springs. Now, business owners also talked with each other about how they can work together and share resources like private security teams to fight this problem. But as the city manager said tonight, this is a systemic issue and there isn't just one, uh, one solution that's going to solve this overnight.